Now we get to meet the artists responsible for the show, Natural Affinity. We have Buffy, Patricia, and Gail joining us. This is a, a, a really interesting mix of, of shapes and textures and styles here. How did this all come about? It came about with uh, the three of us recognizing we all have, we share a love of nature, for one, and recognizing that the way in which we can present our love of nature to the public depends on our media. And there are certain things that I can't, stories I can't tell with photography, but are perfectly suited to glass, and in Gail's case, to clay. So that's certainly part of why we came together. Oftentimes it starts with a walk in the bush or, or Buffy going to the Amazon and talking about what we're seeing, what the images are that she, we want her to take or that she's already taken and how we can create collaborative works or even separate works but based on each other's work. Buffy will go away and, and send me a photograph of this tiny weeny piece of lichen and then uh, the image that I've taken of a photograph with my point and shoot hasn't been good enough so she sends me an image and she, she blows it off much bigger than that. And then, and then, then I can see a use for it in my work. So I take a tiny lichen and make it yay big. And then it's, you know, I can't quite get the colour or I can't quite the, the, get a, an, um, what I want to do with the image I can't quite do in clay. So I'll, I'll, I'll phone Patricia or I'll rush over to Patricia's studio. And uh, it's like, can you make these for me in glass? Because I need these little tiny, whatever Buffy calls those little <laughs> tiny things <laughs> in, my, in, my, in my work. So Patricia will make some in glass and then we'll come together and, and, and lo and behold, we get a piece. How long did it take to get this whole kind of uh, show put together? Year and a half. Yeah, yeah, yeah. As we discussed the different ideas and the different uh, things that we were trying to do, we all were trying different methods to get to where we were going, and some of them went in a different direction yeah. than we thought. So coming yeah. up with this took at least a year and a half. Yeah. What are you hoping that this will will trigger in you? Do you see more collaboration? Is this sort of like an ongoing kind of process? Oh. Um, absolutely for the three of us there's ongoing collaboration. I've thoroughly enjoyed working with Gail and Patricia and I have no doubt that we'll carry on with that collaborative process. It, it stretches, I think each of us have been stretched creatively because of working with, with the other. Um, and I think for me in terms of this exhibit, one of um, my mm, intentions when I photograph is to expose or show to an audience those things in nature that are so often overlooked uh, or people aren't even aware that they exist, right? So I love to take photographs of tiny little things as Gail describes and uh, have them either interpreted in glass or clay or for myself with the photography to show those, those images in nature in a way that, has, that changes the observer's relationship to those things in nature.